All right, what's going on dudes and welcome to me being Iron Man in vanilla Minecraft flying in front of my penthouse that has my name on the window because I'm Tony Stark right now. So I'm in survival flying around in an Iron Man suit, which is just super crazy awesome in vanilla. This is by the same guy who's made a bunch of the other quote unquote vanilla mods that we've we've checked out recently, McMackestein. So oh, why don't we get into things? So first things first, you gotta make a computer. Now you may be asking yourself, how do you do that in Minecraft? Well, we are Tony Stark, so we can kind of just do whatever we want. All we have to do is just throw things on the ground. Pretty simple. So throw a piston on the ground, five iron bars, block of iron, 64 redstone, couple of torches, and voila, we have ourselves a computer. It's that easy when you're Tony Stark. So next up, you have to put the computer down on a, a block of iron that's just sitting on the ground, and you don't really place it, you kind of just throw it and uh, it, it places itself down for you because it's like, oh, hey, Tony Stark, just gonna, I'm, I'm just gonna set myself up because, you know, you're, you're pretty awesome. So thanks, computer. I appreciate it. Now, in order to boot up the computer, we got to throw down a uh, nether star here. Hopefully I can land this in the right spot. 64 redstone and 64 iron. There we go. Constructing Iron Man suit. This is so cool. <laughs> Look at this. Look at Tony Stark's genius at work. I mean, my my genius. I'm referring to myself, Tony Stark, in the third person here. Look, my building is is branded with my last name on it, obviously, because the map comes along with this building and everything. So the suit's set up. You need 100 levels at the same time once you throw down those items as well. So I started at 206, now I'm at 106. So it's, it takes a little bit to work towards if you want to put this into your survival world. Anyway, so the way we put on the suit is uh, we jump down. Jarvis helps us out, puts the suit on for us, and voila, from Tony Stark to Iron Man. Pretty awesome, right? So the way all the abilities work is you basically drop and then right click the item, which sounds kind of strange, but here, let's do a little, little example of it. So we'll start flying first, because that's probably the most important thing. In order to make that work, you want to navigate to the eighth slot in your inventory, which is the activate flight item, and then you're gonna wanna drop it and also right click while sort of looking at a down-ish angle from the top of a ledge. It's kind of specific, but it should work if we get it right and there we go. All right, so now we're flying around. Kind of kind of confined in here, but still, wherever you look is where you go and you just float about looking kind of awesome, like Iron Man, because that's what we are. And uh, let's go ahead and, and head outside because it feels a little bit claustrophobic in here now. <laughs> All right, there we go, much better. What a view we've got from up here. So once you're flying, you can use some of the other abilities. Well, you don't have to be flying to, to use some of the others, but when it comes to the, uh, the slow down and speed up, you definitely do. So we can throw that out, start going a little bit faster, or we could throw down the, uh, the slower, slow down a little bit, slow down even more so, or speed back up to go into uh, normal flight. So again, that's just done by dropping the item out of your inventory. It doesn't look like I'm dropping it because it immediately reappears, but that's how you do it. I can go down. I can be like, no, dive, 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 dive. We're not in a submarine, but there we Oh, look at all the villagers. Look at all the great citizens of New York. They're, they look, they're just having a great day, except unfortunately, they're going to be my guinea pigs when it comes to uh, demoing kind of the, the other items that we've got. So, <laughs> All right, let's check out the other weapons and whatnot. So first and foremost, we've got, and we'll go back into first person here, we've got ourselves a fireball. So let me actually stop flying here. And uh, I am so sorry, villagers, but I, I've got to just shoot my fireball. And then if I drop the item, it drops down this, uh, it does this active ability where it splits the fireball into another subset, and then it rains it down on the ground. So that's triggered whenever I, I drop the item. And boom. Pretty cool. <laughs> Pretty awesome, actually. So I think it's it's a bow and arrow, but made much more special. Something like that. Now, we've also just got the basic punch. So I don't know if I walk up to a, a poor, hapless citizen of the town here and punch them. Um, I'm, you didn't see. I'm, I'm just... I'm doing human experiments. They're looking at me like, I, what, what have you done, Tony? You're supposed to help people, not kill them. Yeah, we can't have this. Okay, you're done. No, one, no witnesses. No, wit I, no one else is paying... Maybe, maybe he was paying attention. Oh, he's like, nope, nope, I wasn't paying attention. Okay, 
<laughs> so we've also got this this little other launcher thing, which um, you can fire at at villagers. It doesn't really do anything unless it actually hits uh, 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 a mob. Like it doesn't look like anything fancy. Um, but when it hits something, it uh, has a chance to kill them. Well, in fact, it, it pretty reliably kills them. So that's just called shoot, basically. Uh, this is fireball. This is punch. And now we have the uh, the bomb ability as well. So this is a cool one that we could use if we actually want to. Uh, these actually are a couple cool ones that are, are good to use when flying, which there we go. All right. So we can shoot people from the air. Nyerp. Nyerp. Boom. I'm such a terrible Iron Man. <laughs> I really am. And then the bomb, on the other hand. Hold on. Let's go up to the sky. I'm hitting something. And drop the bomb. There we go. And the bomb splits into another bunch of bombs, and then it goes kaboom, and uh, it does a lot of damage. Actually, it would probably help if we just sit on a, uh, a roof over here, and then go and use the bomb thing. Here we go, drop it on down, boom. And watch it, splits into eight more, I think, and then... God, that thing does a lot of damage, that's awesome. <laughs> I mean, it's not awesome, we're, we're testing on innocent civilians, but I mean, it is what it is. You gotta do what you gotta do to ensure that your weapons are working properly. All right, so now let's move into the uh, the final item, which is actually a combination of two. It's the uh, the pickup and the throw. I'm gonna see if I can get this to work because it requires a, a bit of timing coordination here. But what we're gonna want to do is activate our flight again. If I can get the angle correct here, a little bit tricky sometimes. All right, there we go. Just took a little bit of uh, finagling to get the uh, the flying to work. You know that. Jarvis hasn't quite worked out all the all the bugs yet with the suit, which I guess means I haven't worked out all the bugs yet with Jarvis, or he would have known how to do it already. But you know, it it's, it is what it is. So <laughs> the final final ability then. Um, so first off, we want to do the the pickup. So it could be a little bit tough. We want to get into an open, more open area over here. So we're gonna try to get down close enough to one of the citizens and pick him up. There we go. So that was a drop and right click, and now. <laughs> We, we, if we were good, we would, we would carry them to safety. Um, but since I kind of want to demo the other counterpart of the ability, we have the throw, which is that, um, well, one sec, rest in pieces. And he did. Sorry. I just, I just, the, the great, the great citizens, um, since the way this actually works is you're riding a horse occasionally, like you kind of bump into something. That's why I occasionally like stop flying in. Wait, did I get it? I got it. Wait. Oh, I gotta, oh, oh, I'm gonna feel so bad. It's, it's a child. It's a small child, and, uh, now I am about to drop it. Uh, I'm sorry. Well, rest in pieces. <laughs> All right, I think I was able to fix the suit, so let's, um, let's try actually being kind to someone. Um, <laughs> here we go, and let's pick him up. All right. I've always had a lot of kids tell me that they, they want to come up to my penthouse, take a tour, like it's been a dream of theirs, so I'm gonna take this dude up, and instead of dropping him to his death uh, Maybe we'll just give him a tour. So I'll drop him off on the balcony. Yeah, it'll be great All right. Have you ever wanted to come up to Stark Tower? Of course you have and let's drop him off there. We oh That's unfortunate um, Nobody saw that nobody nobody saw all right. Nobody saw it. I think we're done with Iron Man for the day after that one That was a uh, whoops a bit of a mishap right there. All right. That's embarrassing. Okay. Well, um whenever you're done uh, being Iron Man for the day, uh, all you gotta do is walk back to the machine and jump back on it, and Jarvis uh, should remove our suit, and then we'll be good to walk off, <laughs> so that we don't have to accidentally kill any uh, other poor hapless uh, citizens of New York today. Sorry, poor hapless citizen. I really was trying to drop him on the balcony, and uh, it didn't quite work out as planned. So, well. That was um that was the Iron Man suit in uh, vanilla Minecraft. Pretty cool stuff. We may as well go and check out the the redstone as well, because why not? Um, as you would probably expect, pretty decent amount of command blocks in order to make this stuff work. A lot of it again having to do with armor stands and items parented to armor stands and all sorts of crazy stuff with that. But you know, it's uh it's pretty pretty nifty. So. Good job to Big Macastein 
again, pretty, pretty awesome. So hopefully you've enjoyed. If you have, a rating would be super duper, very much appreciated. Jarvis, put my suit on. I'm, I'm going to go and save the day. By save the day, I mean I'm, I'm probably going to end up accidentally doing bad things to more people, which uh, I probably shouldn't do. But, uh, oh well, these things do <laughs> Things do happen. I don't know why this is exploding on me now, but that's probably not what we want to be doing. And wait, speed up. And fire away. Fire away. Fire and thing. I don't I almost just traded. Okay. I think our job here is done for the day. <laughs> oh dear. Alright, I'll see you guys later.